Hello everyone, Jay with Mobile Home Partnership bringing you another video. So, we are located not far from Savannah, Georgia. I'm actually inside of one of the homes inside of uh, Mobile Home Community Park now. I will get more details on all the above, but just wanted to do a quick little tour around the, the home here, what I'm looking at. Current wide. Let's see here, so we are in the master bedroom, bathroom at this time. Go ahead and tell you just from the looks of it, I mean, you know, if I were to guess, I would say this was a tenant. They got evicted, maybe. You know, this is usually what you tend to find. Stuff like this, you know, just obviously purposely done certain things. So this this home is not in horrible condition. It needs a lot of, like I said, I mean, you know, things like this, you know, they just don't happen. You know, this is purposely done. So that's why I mentioned that. But so far i liked it i walked it one time and just doing my little tour i got about 15 of these that i'm looking at these are all going to be handyman specials if i decide to to let them go i'm probably going to lock up a few of my own and create rent to owns out of them so again you know a lot of wall fixture i mean and this is easy fixes you can replace this whole sheet right here obviously but carpet uh gone i say this carpet needs to be replaced immediately I'm stepping on a bit of a soft spot right here, so I don't know what that's about. But definitely, once you replace that carpet, you'll be able to check that out as well. Again, you know, malicious. That's what this is right here. You have no reason to take those walls apart unless you're just purposely trying to take them apart, if you will. So, electrical, I don't see major issues, but obviously something like that, you know. Wire just hanging right there, something to check out. I see a leak right here. I, um... I don't see anything on the floor but kind of fresh definitely looks a little bit fresh so something to check into obviously the roof needs some addressing i don't see any major ceiling uh leaks other than this one spot here so obviously the roof is for the most part okay yeah yeah i feel soft spots right here where obviously it's been leaking so it needs to be addressed immediately but uh three bedroom two bath double wide 28 by it's kind of short i want to say 50 60 maybe i don't know i'd have to check it out but again more damages here just you know a bunch of little repairs that are going to be needed at one point this was a very nice property very nice home so and we plan on doing the same bringing it back up so i like this one moving into the back bedrooms here's the second bathroom uh, that has water damage as well as you can see let's see if i can zoom in for you so you can see around it that's the reason that came down that fan but could have had some malicious accent to it as well as you can see i mean just stuff like this but i mean there's no major damages in here that i'm seeing at this time i mean the floor seemed pretty solid other than a couple of spots i'm gonna walk them a little bit better here in a minute of course walk-in closet like it again let's find something to punch right coming into the third bedroom right here another walk-in closet partial carpet doesn't look that bad in here maybe in these bedrooms here could use a good shampoo good cleanup and good to go ceiling in here looks great no damages this wall these are easy fixes I mean you know that this time consuming can be uh material you know three four sheets of sheetrock you're good to go so it's just you know a lot of that little fix it build it back together kind of thing i like this one this one checks out if i was gonna say what i'm gonna do with this one i say this one i think i'm gonna keep i don't know we'll see gotta check the electrical gotta check the plumbing gotta see how long it's been sitting this way and definitely get on that roof and let's seal that we don't need any more of this coming in here absolutely when you see these right here you know if you're if you're taking a property like this you know the first thing you need to do is you need to fix this from the outside which means the top you don't want any more of that damage coming in definitely don't ruin it any more than it already is so I like this property this one checks out i would say it's a go for rto so but yeah i'm located uh near savannah i got about 15 of these message me if you're in this area i'll go ahead and tell you i don't come out here as much as i should and wow i did not realize how many mobile homes are out here if you're in this market 
and you're a mobile home investor, you better have zero reasons as to why you're not investing, flipping, wholesaling, etc. They are everywhere, okay? If I can help you in any way, you know you can reach me at 770-855-1298. Email me, jgarcia at mobilehomepartner.com. Visit our page for coaching options at mobilehomepartner.com. All right, till next time, thank you for watching.